Hey guys, I want to show you how you can control which visuals are controlled by a slicer and how to control which visuals affect other visuals. In front of us here we have a dashboard and it shows populations. Up here we have continents. On this side we have countries. This is a slicer and this is also a slicer. Now, if I select, I make selections on the co continent, you can see that it's affecting all the visuals. Like that. You can see all the visuals are being affected by the choices that I make here. For example, right now, I only have South America selected and all the visuals here are just showing South America. All right, now, I want to reset this if I come to this side these are countries only for example I'm going to choose just one country Albania and you can see it's affecting my visuals even though this is just by continent I don't want this to happen so how to do this I'll come to format edit interactions and now you can see that each visual has filter or none i'm going to click none and for this visual i believe this is it here i'll click none now you can see that these two visuals are not being controlled by this slicer a very easy way of doing that likewise i would also like to control how visuals affect each other when i click on this visual it affects everything else and I don't want that to happen for example I'll click on Pakistan and you can see that it affects the continent and I don't want this to happen so what I'll do here is again just like the slicer you can see that we have options to filter highlight or none in this case I'm just going to choose none so you have to select the visual and then I'll choose none and you can see that these two will not, no longer be affected by this. Sometimes you want to copy a slicer from one page to another. Over here, right here, I've cre created a duplicate of page one here and I've removed the slicers. Just to demonstrate, I'll go back to page one. I'll select this slicer copy and I'll come to the second page and paste you can see that it asks me one or more visuals was copied and it can stay in sync with the visual it was copied from do you want to keep them in sync this is a simple way of making sure that all the pages are being controlled by your slicers in my case i'll probably choose none because i'll have different visuals here but sometimes you have situations where you want the visual to control all pages at once so this is one way this is a simple way of getting that done in my case i would choose don't sync so any changes i make here for example let's say for example i'm going to choose south america europe asia and africa you can see that actually let's just leave one if South America, you can see this is just South America, but if I get, come to page one, these are not affected. I'll come back to page one. I'm going to remove this and I'm going to paste it again just to show you. And this time I'm going to choose sync. So again, I'm going to select a few countries, I mean a few continents. Well, let's just leave africa and asia selected this is page two or duplicate of page one if i go back to page one you can see it's the same in other words the selections i make here will also be applied on the other page so you can sync slicers easily using this way or choose not to do it at all lastly i would like to show you how to reset your slicers up here we have an image if you come to format when you select the image you have this action 
you can choose to clear all slices or apply all slices so in my case here I've chosen clear all slices so if I come here and choose a few countries so you can see for example then I'll come here click on that and you can see that you can see that it has cleared all the slices if you like this video be sure to subscribe to our channel like this video and share it with your friends thanks for watching